modify our rabbit sleds, rabbit tractors a little bit today. Rather than riding straight on the ground where the, uh, the wire mesh kind of flattens the grass, we're going to put some new 2x2 two two pieces just underneath along the runners so that it raises it up a little bit. We've noticed that the rabbit poop just kind of clogs underneath a little bit and we're hoping that by raising it up it'll just keep the keep the rabbit hutch a little bit cleaner. Come here George. It's okay. Yes. Oh you're a good rabbit. As long as we're modifying these rabbit tractors, I'm going to go ahead and put in a new hay box for them. Just hopefully it'll be a little nicer than what we've been using. letting it poke through a little bit so I can find my uh, pilot hole down below and uh, slot it right in. I can give you guys a better look at that. Yeah, we can do that. Mm, so poor 
We've got a couple of other modifications for this rabbit sled, but George can stay in there while I do these. What I've got here is a little length of chain with uh, key rings attached to it. This will keep the lid from stressing out the, uh, the hinges too much when we, when we open the lid. It's nice to uh, have a few more functional improvements to this uh, rabbit, rabbit tractor, rabbit sled, mobile, mobile rabbit hutch, whatever you want to call it. A lot of things are kind of like this. They don't have to be perfect to begin with. A lot of times you can fix them as you go along. The hose just fell on its handle. <laughs> 